We're in the sporting goods section of Meyer. Meyer, for those that don't have them, it's kind of your everything store, including groceries and a bunch of other stuff, right? Yeah. But we thought we'd film because they've updated their knives. They restocked. To the point where they're better than some of these other places that we've been going to lately. That is true, yeah. And this is, this is a, a grocery store. It's pretty good. So, okay, Victorinox. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Buck. Have I we handled... feel like I have to work when I'm here. The tinker goes over here. Put those in the right spot. You Jeez, are the, guys. You are the tinker. Okay, if we're yeah. looking at the okay. if we're looking at the top row here. Mm -hmm. I like the looks of this. It looks like a, like an arrowhead, doesn't it? Yeah. Uh-huh. It's the heater too. There's the sheath. Interesting okay, little here, thing. Here. <laughs> It's oh. the titanium non-stick blade. Mm -hmm. It's a titanium blade. Yeah. Okay. It's got the finger hole textured handle bottle Everybody opener. Everybody loves a good finger hole. Full tang. Mm -hmm. $25. I don't know. Yeah. The dime is always a good multi-tool. That's one of my favorite EDC multi-tools. Yeah. Um, the sides and all the capability that they have. Just everything considered and the price. Mm -hmm. Right. Okay. Camillus. Yeah, it's kind of a budgety brand. I compare it with like well, Gerber. Look at honestly. this now. It's crossbar lock. Yeah. For nineteen ninety nine. Mm -hmm. What's the steel? Four twenty. Yeah. Four twenty. So it's soft as a stick of butter. Mm hmm. But you know. But it's better than. Wouldn't you say it's better than seven CR? I don't know. Uh, somebody, or at least comparable. Somebody in the audience might have to help mm -hmm. us with that right now. Yeah for $59.99? I don't know. It's smooth. Everybody is always like, these are such a good deal. I think this is what most people want to buy is the $60 buck one too. Well, isn't this what Elias likes? Yeah, it is. Yeah, and everybody says it's too dangerous for a child. Right. He already had one when we bought it's him one. It's fine, yeah. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. It's because we're not, not ours. It's because we're not parents. <laughs> it's not ours. <laughs> yeah. Um, I don't yeah. know. I don't know. Eh, eh, yeah, I think a lot of people still you can love just, Buck, but eh. you can get so much better. Sorry, if you if That's you're in need like and you're the in the worst store. Thing that you can say. Okay. Okay. Anyways, here's some Gerber's, just these little baby things. This is kind of interesting. What is that? It's like a multi-tool, but for like camping. It's called the Stakeout. Mm -hmm. It's sixty dollars, so it's not cheap. Yeah. Eleven tools. A tent stake puller. Mm -hmm. All right. Because, you know, it's hard to pull up the stakes with your finger. Well, if you had a... It's all dirty. You have to put your finger in, like, this dirty section and pull dirty it up. hole. You don't like doing that? Um, no, if, I mean, yeah. somebody let us know if that's... It has little tweezers, too. If that's um, an appealing tool. Yeah. What's an owl? An owl. Owl. An owl. Owl. Yeah. Owl. Yeah. <laughs> that's what I was going to say. Sixty dollars. Okay. I thought this one was kind of neat looking. For the kind of stuff that we typically look at and we carry and mm -hmm. we like, the lighting. this is the most um, appealing, but not the seven CR. Eye catching. Yeah, seven CR. Mm -hmm. What is it? It's only thirty dollars. So yeah. It's not bad. It's kind of nice looking. I like the looks yeah. of it. Yeah. I wonder what the action's like. It's a liner lock. Uh huh. It's corrosion resistant. Right. Resistant. So I like my, how this one has a, so my a socks. anti steel and it's twenty nine ninety nine and so is this one. This twenty nine ninety nine and it doesn't have an anti steel. Or like this one that's sixty dollars. It's it's more expensive, but it whatever. I don't work here. I would be confused if I did. Okay, this is what I wanted to look at, right? Okay. Yeah. So what's the price? Twenty nine ninety nine. Okay. We've been looking at some of these utility folding. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Folding knives? Do you call them folding knives? Folding utility razors? Yeah, okay. I don't know. That one's not folding, but yeah. Um, we just looked at the Olight, the mm -hmm. O-Knife brand, just yesterday in a video, and that was $25. This is $30. Yeah. Thank you, but no thanks. Right. Uh -huh. Yeah. That's yeah. called the Pribid. Pribid. It has eight tools. Okay, it's got a couple extra tools. Yeah. But are these tools you would actually use? Probably. Wire stripper pry bar. Flat driver nail puller. Mm -hmm. I don't know. You guys let us know. Yeah. It's not appealing. That size, it's bulky. It's it feels heavy for what it yeah, is. Yeah, it is. I'd rather carry the machete. Right. 
Go what else do we have? Tools. What's that? It looks open. It fell behind. Oh. Which is interesting. Now so this is an eighty dollar. What's the MP four hundred? It's not the MP forty. No. That's a thing, everybody. Everybody mm -hmm. knows that, right? Yeah. Yeah. The suspension is forty. Yeah. So this one's fifty. Wait. Why would you get this one over this one? Because this one has 11 tools, this one has 15. Yeah, it's double the price. Mm-hmm. With less tools. It comes with a sheath. Maybe what's you're a, paying $40 for what's a What's above it? The truss? It's somewhere in the middle price-wise. Yeah. 17 tools. It seems like this would be the best one. Perhaps. I think we've had one of these ones before, too. The little curve thing. Let's show that. This is $20. Mm -hmm. Probably not bad. I've it's never, just a cute little thing. I've never used one. We have one somewhere in the house. <laughs> yeah. I like this little hatchet. It's cute and short, like me. Cute and short. It is short. It doesn't have much uh -uh. actual length on the handle there. Yeah, but it's perfect for my size. Okay. Okay, about $45, and then there's more over here. Do we even look at these ones? Oh, look, this is like a, a swedge knife. Look, it's like a, it's good for batoning. Is the, no, okay, I was gonna say, is the, is the outer edge on that? Um, is that sharp? Uh, chiseled front? tip, but look, yeah. it really is for batoning. Look, they make it nice and durable up there too. Okay. So you yeah. can hammer on it. What was the price on this? 20 bucks. 20, all right. Look at this thing. This thing's weird looking too. If you're in a pinch and you need a knife, right? Yeah. You might get one here. What weird. Was, let's see. Weird, this has, okay, look at this. This is something interesting. It's like all kinds of stuff on it. So it has the blade, knife, it has a knife sharpener in the sheath. Oh yeah, one of those. Yeah, yeah. look. Isn't that yeah. weird? So you're good to go. Uh-huh, yeah, this is well, all you need to survive in life. Speaking of that though, they do have some sharpeners. Yeah. Down here. This one's like twenty dollars. Diamond tungsten ceramic. Yeah. And then there's one for scissors. Oh, uh -huh. This little one. All right. Well, we were just saying because we were just talking about dicks. Uh huh. They have a better selection here than dicks. Than a dicks. Yeah. Right. They even have Glock 19s here. Yeah. yeah, Glock 19. Now we have to rate this video. Um, differently we have to uh because of weapons because of the weapons yeah look and this one's even opened oh may as well may as well show everybody watch where you're pointing that thing i know i know Let it's a see. stinger p311 like the band that's co2 right yeah yeah airsoft yeah i'm gonna put it there we go put that back these are fun would be fun. These gel BBs, do these hurt less when you get hit by them? I'm not familiar with that. Oh, here's splatter balls. Whoa, this is like a, look at this, this is a blaster glove. Where were these, that, this, these BBs you were talking about? Oh, these gel ones. Gel? That's new for me. I don't yeah. know. Oh, they're tiny though. What the mm -hmm. heck are these? What it's splatters? What shoots these? Um, because that's not a standard size BB. Gel blaster. Would it be this? What the hell is that? It looks. It's a hand. You put it on your hand and it shoots. Weird. <laughs> okay, and that's seventy dollars. Look at that. That's this crazy. This would be fun. Interesting. Very fun. There's a Tommy gun. This was the style. Well, no. That you used to have? I was gonna say, yeah, when I was a kid, there was like five or six varieties of BB guns. Now they have a lot more. Yeah, uh, I like do. this too, the Tommy gun style. Uh -huh. uh, $90 on that one. Full auto. Is it, it's 
she it's broke. HK. She broke it. Now it's damaged. It's discounted. Uh -huh. yep. What do you mean full auto? It's full auto. No, it's not. Read right here. I can read, but I don't. It's full auto. I don't believe that. You would go through those babies like crazy. <laughs> Could you imagine? Oh my gosh. And the splatter ball. Here, you can go look over here because um, there's some other fishermen type knives and cinch over here. But look at this. Okay, I'll, I'll go over here where you're talking. I'm just going to say it over here because oh, there's this, some random stuff. This stuff's no fun. It's like fishing knives. We have, no, just kidding. We have, we have fishermen in our audience. Yeah, we're just fillet knives. Interesting. Oh, people are trying to buy alcohol before noon. Not I was allowed. I was worried they were gonna announce like there's no filming firearms uh -huh. in the store or something yeah. like that. No, no, it's no, no alcohol. You can't, you can't buy alcohol before noon. Uh, but what kind of ammo do they have here? Not very much. Shotgun load. Mm -hmm. Does everybody know that bird shot? is a type of shotgun load. Yeah. It's that right there. Yes, I do. I've been taught that. Okay, wrap it up. All right. No, this is it. We have places to go, people to see. Yeah, we do, right? Yeah. It's Sunday morning. We're the <laughs> only ones awake right now. That and the people trying to buy alcohol. Yeah, that's true, yeah. Gonna have to wait in the parking lot. All right, well, that's it. Yeah, it's just funny how this place, mostly a grocery store, you know, um, beats dicks, right? That sounds wrong, to beat dicks. Well, they do it. We all, all right. do it. <laughs> Thanks a lot for joining us. See, Bye. there's groceries down there. Mm -hmm. Make sure to subscribe to our ridiculousness. <laughs> exactly. All right, she's gonna get laundry soap. All right, if they're still here, we can show them what a real edc -er, er carries. <laughs> er. edc -er. Yeah. edc -er? Should I unload my pockets? We didn't have to buy anything because no. we're well equipped. Right? Yeah. I have this. You always have this. This. Can I flick this one? It's a back lock, so it's yeah. a little harder. I love that. This and this. I love that blade. I have the Chiro, and this is the original one of ours. This is the one that I found in the, the um, driveway that was like rusted over. I had found it. It was in the driveway for like three years. Yeah. Or the grass next to the driveway. Any other knives? Oh, let's see here. Mm -hmm. I have this QSP. What is the name of this? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> it's new. Then I always have this stuff on me too. Look, I even have my pen. I got her that. That's the I Nintendo, used it yesterday. That's the Nintendo special. Yeah. We'll show everybody. Here, this. That's the tactile. With the reset button. Uh huh. Yeah, tactile turn. Yeah. Turns out they have good pens. Uh huh. Yeah. I have this too. We got this from in New York, and I had it custom engraved. At the actual Victorinox or yeah. Swiss Army place that yeah. is? It says 2019, and then on this side it has Birdshot Ivy. Yeah. Uh-huh. Anyway, whatever model this is, we'll probably do a separate video on it. Yeah. I really like it. And what else do I have usually on me? Well, if we were in my car, then I have all my stuff in there, too. This is just... This is always in the car. Purse carry. This is often in the car or keychain, right? Uh -huh. Here's my key bar. Yeah. With our post office box key. Some other crap. I need to charge this every now and then. Yeah, look, I even have like a stock of stickers. If you run into us. Uh-huh. Yeah. And then I have this leather pouch that a viewer made us. Chapstick. I like how you're just like... This oh. is everything. I already showed this like a month ago or something, but uh -huh. these are nice. This was in a going gear a while ago. I have used it for a wallet, and it works really nicely for a wallet. I put 
stuff in it. And then I claimed this. So this is in my purse too. From a going gear? Yep. Yep. Oh, and did you know that it, it must have been something that I put in here a while ago? And I just have it randomly on me at all times too. One of the newest Victorinoxes. That's newer than the other one? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, this one can't hold a knife. He's holding suckers. Maybe we should do another run of those. Let us know. Yeah. All right. Should anyway, we? That's Meyer. Maybe they maybe they don't beat your local dicks, but they're impressive for what they are. I right? like it yeah. to say that um, places beat dicks. Or like we beat dicks. It's fun to say. Because that's her maturity. All right. Uh -huh. Thanks a lot for joining us. Bye.